Hello there, very good. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome for, uh, to your reading for the month of April. We're going to jump straight into your reading and we're going to clarify a couple of uh, information and bits and pieces and we're going to check exactly what's happening to you in the month of uh, April. Uh, I've prepared uh, three rows. Uh, we're going to have a row for the, uh, for the month of what kind of energy will the month of April bring you? Uh, we will also clarify um, how you can get and uh, the most out of the month of April, as well as uh, something to be mindful of in the month uh, ahead of you. Uh, at the end, we're going to have three yes or no uh, uh, pick a card uh, uh, questions. So I'm going to answer them yes and no as if I know the question. Okay, so you've got a time, uh, you will have a time to pose it. You also have uh, down below in the description of this video, you've got uh, a timestamp uh, so you can rewind and go straight uh, forward to the pick a, pick a card, a yes or no kind of question. Uh, question okay uh, but uh, yeah let me just clarify a bit with the cards of what's exactly in store for yourself uh, right you've got the electric uh, eel uh, spirit bring your ideas to life uh, you've got the uh, cat spirit claim your independence Okay, um, and you've got uh, Dove Spirit Be Peace. Okay, Be Peace. Um, right, just turn those around. I need those. In, re in regards to uh, uh, the general energy for the month of uh, April, um, uh, I think it to, you will you're ready to be um, for the, another stage in your life. And I'm pretty sure that refers to your workplace, uh, Virgo. Uh, it's like you've been waiting for a quite a long time to start something new or you've already started something new um, and uh, you will need to use your creativity, your like new ideas and um, s something huge is happening in your life and it's a massive change. Um, and uh, yes, you might not exactly see it just yet, Virgo, but uh, I'm telling you this is the best uh, time for you to start some kind of new projects or some kind of new uh, work and um, uh, you will have uh, a lot of uh, uh, like uh, re in the card of uh, uh, Zen card readiness you got loads of apples okay and pretty much that's it like they are ready to be eaten it's gonna be sweet it's gonna be amazing um, and it's gonna be moist I mean like I can go for it uh, I, I can go on for, for uh, forever but it's gonna be just the, the best uh, outcome ever the abundance is coming to you and uh, you need to just remember that okay it just don't uh, because at the same time I can see a bit of a blockage that uh, sometimes you just not maybe believe in yourself as such uh, but uh, but you should because you're an amazing creator and uh, those cards are just showing me that uh, wherever you're thinking about starting uh, right now it's going to be incredible Incredible, okay, um, and the, the outcome will be will be amazing. But maybe you just need a bit of more time in order to achieve that goal. Okay, so it's just a bit of a time. You've got four of. Uh, um, remember about um, finding time for yourself and to slow down a bit as well. Okay, because at the moment in here, what I can see is that uh, you're working quite a lot, and uh, yes, it's amazing to achieve something and to have some kind of perks like you know abundance out of it. Uh, but remember that without your health, you can't support others. Okay, so just uh, remember about your own health and about your own um, about your own. Um, mind okay and just try to calm it as much as you can um, uh, yeah so before you will leave your day job or before you will make a transition remember just take one step at the head um, and uh, learn from it grow from it uh, and then you will achieve your goal okay and then you will be actually able to um, make uh, some kind of judgment or you can you can make some kind of decisions okay um, Again, I can see in here that uh, in if you're thinking uh, if, that you're thinking about meditation a lot or the contemplation, and it's uh, 
that's what you should uh, go to uh, to that space of mind and frame of mind um, if you want to calm down and slow down a bit okay uh, but uh, yeah definitely a really good uh, month okay and really enough in your previous readings for the you know weekly readings and monthly readings uh, pretty much uh, I could see exactly the same thing um, like you're moving towards something much greater and much better and you're going to be very very happy with the outcome of it okay uh, but uh, how you can get the most out of the month of uh, April you've got cat spirit claim your independence and pretty much that's it like if you were thinking about um, um, so if you're thinking about uh, starting some kind of new job working for yourself this is the best time ever to try yourself and to try uh, to try it out if you're actually able to do it and if you will be okay with it okay um, you need to believe in yourself, so I've got Believe card in here uh, again. It's very strange because the, in Taurus's card and I think Aries's card, uh, this card showed up as well. And it's uh, you have to be very, very uh, um, grounded at the same time. You know when you achieve your 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 dreams, your goals. Um, but at the same time, you believe. You need to believe in yourself. You need to believe that you're uh, uh, that you're capable of creating uh, that perfect uh, um, that perfect outcome. Okay, I can see in here that you shouldn't be worried. That you're gonna be just fine. Okay, uh, you've got the uh, Queen of Air. Yeah, just to make a neutral kind of decisions, okay? Don't rush into anything, just one stage at a time, one step at a time, uh, one day at a time, okay? Um, uh, yeah, just get rid of the uh, uh, clutter from your life, okay? Get rid of the things which you don't uh, like or which are not uh, beneficial for you whatsoever, okay? Just get rid of it. Um, and uh, yeah, just uh, have a bit of a laugh and just... Uh, just uh, when you um, um, put yourself into some into some something new, just uh, smile, okay? Just smile a bit, and uh, just be very uh, positive about it, okay? Especially the new things which you are trying out, okay? Just don't be too um, too. Uh, stress about it okay just I think the cards want me to tell you just to just relax a bit okay about everything what you do at the moment okay just stop stressing okay because everything is going into in uh, towards the very good direction okay and um, something to be mindful of in the month of uh, April uh, I think peace and uh, um, and uh, you're thinking and you're you're thinking way too much about the change and about uh, um, about uh, the next step instead of living here and now and just take advantage out of what you've got around you just be very very happy with it um, so so yeah just uh, meditate meditate and just try to calm yourself down as much as you can and that way uh, once you relax you're gonna achieve things much much quicker okay yeah, it's a, it's you got eight of the. Uh, I mean, like it's an illusion that you're uh, in a cage, okay, or if you, uh, that you're locked down, okay. Um, I mean, like yes, we are in the lockdown, national lockdown, but uh, I'm talking about you and your own uh, feelings. Your very strange. It's like it's like your relation. Yeah, like you're you're in the relationship. You feel like you're uh, caged, like you like you're like you're a bird in a cage uh, and you're not okay you can you've got uh, um, I think what this card refers to as well is that uh, you're um, you just don't believe uh, sometimes in yourself okay and uh, and uh, that uh, lack of belief uh, uh, makes you uh, very caged and alienated from others okay so just believe in yourself and uh, uh, don't be afraid of making mistakes because mistakes uh, teach you a lot. Okay, they actually mistakes are teaching us much more than the actual positives. Okay, so just grow from it, grow from your mistakes and uh, embrace them. Okay, very good. But let me just get a bit of more clarification for you. You've got seven of earth, you've got uh, queen of uh, water, and you've got eight of fire. Um, 
Yeah, in terms of the work and in terms of what you are doing now and what you are, what you have planned, what kind of you've planned, you've placed that seed, okay, and it's going to grow and it's going to grow very quick and you will be very amazed with with where you want to, where where you will get with it. Um, um, yes, sometimes it will feel like uh, nothing is happening, okay, but at the same time we, uh, things are happening in the background which you can't see, okay, and people are noticing you, everything is going into, uh, um, in, uh, towards the right direction and uh, the cards are saying to me, stop worrying about it, okay, stop worrying about it and just leave it and it's going to be perfect, okay. Um, um, your relationship is reaching a new level. Um, trust your intuition um, and uh, just take care of yourself uh, um, and others around you in terms of your family. Okay, so that's the Queen of uh, of uh, Water. Okay, the Eight of uh, Fire. Uh, things are going very very quickly, um, and uh, there won't be any blockages as such. Um, a lot of things are happening uh, in the background. Okay, so it's you can't make this stuff up. Like it, it, it's all in this card written at the bottom. Um, uh, again, amazing, amazing Virgo reading uh, for the month of uh, April. But uh, let us do uh, yes or no cards um, and see what's in store. Okay, so just think about the questions um, and you can pose now. Um, and uh, yeah, let's just go with it. Okay, so first uh, question uh, Nine of Wands. I would say yes, but it will be uh, quite hard to work in order for you to achieve it. Okay, but I would say yes. Okay, uh, question number two uh, Five of Wands in reverse. Um, I would say no because there's just not, uh, it's not. Uh, clear enough uh, in order for you to have uh, any uh, benefits out of it okay so but I would say no I would say no there's too much confusion that's what I, what I get confusion uh, no don't do it um, and uh, question number three uh, you've got the chariot and um, I would say definitely yes uh, you know there's a lady on a chariot and she's going towards the, that some kind of direction and I would say definitely yes it, it's going to be very quick it's going to be very very good and it's going to be very very enjoyable um, and um, and it will bring you quite a lot of abundance as well in the future okay so I would say definitely yes but yes, there we go. So this is your reading for the month of April. Please check my um, my weekly readings uh, and also check the playlists uh, which are in here and in there uh, or in one of those places. Um, but uh, but yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I shall see you next week. Bye.